Today I'm back with a new video for you guys. I'm here with my brother. This is And today we have a special video for you guys. It's gonna be something a bit different than what we usually do because you know we usually have like taste test videos and things. But today's video is going to be a how well do you know me challenge where he's gonna ask me questions about himself and I'm gonna answer it like to the best of my knowledge and then I'm gonna ask the same question about myself and whoever gets a wrong answer will be tallied on this chart. And the person with the most wrong answers in the end will have to have a spoon of extra hot chili sauce, which should be interesting considering that I can't handle chili at all. And I don't know about you. I don't think I can, if I'm gonna be honest. Yeah. Not that chili. So it should be eventful. I can handle chili, but not that chili. God damn. <laughs> a little bit about us, you guys, if you don't already know, Azam is my older brother. He's always been close to me. Obviously, as kids, um, we did fight quite a bit. I think that's kind of normal though, isn't it? Like, do you think that's normal? Ah, uh, you know, brothers and sisters fights. Yeah, and now we're arguments, like, but... we're like close and stuff. We do have disagreements at times, but we consider ourselves as twins because we're so much alike. Similar interests. Although Azam is the lame one and I'm like the coolest sibling, so. In reverse. Can you guys remember, right, when we used to play, um, we used to play like Grand Theft Auto or whatever on PlayStation 1? Or like PlayStation 2 and it always used to skip and jump and then you always had to like press the button and on PlayStation 1 it used to flip open then you had to like go get your top and go shh on it and then like put it back in close it and then like restart it again do you remember that? I remember that I remember playing GTA London where you had to put the first you had to buy two GTA games and they were both at full price at the time I remember this you had to buy GTA the first one then you had to buy GTA London Right, London was it wasn't any cheaper. It was the same price as the, as the other one. But you to play London, you had to put the first game in, take the disc out, then put the other one. So essentially, it's like DLC, but without DLC. Did it charge the same price for the London one as it is for the rest? Yeah. So essentially, they got the money as the money was for, but yeah, because all they did is just put new textures in and really bad voice acting. You know what game really let me down? The Men in Black game? Because you, you bought it because you thought Will Smith was the actor and it wasn't, it was just some random guy. It's a voice actor, yeah, he just got some random African American guy going <laughs> Yeah, and you're like, that's not, that's not his one. Talking about video, video games, I remember arcades were the cool thing. Do you remember arcades? Arcades with the ting, you know. With the ting? <laughs> the arcades with the ting, you know. What's the next thing we have to the video and go, Skrrr, pop, 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 pop. Skrr. Now this is exactly what I need to live with, a nerd that goes, I think she's rap gangster. What are you in for IMG, you know? Right, in this video, we are just going to say some random stuff. Like, uh, all you've got to do is focus on the future. Chicken the key. Chicken is like everything. Chicken is everything. Chicken. <laughs> chicken. Chick 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 Even in that song, Chaka Khan. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so let's get straight into it. Okay, first question. I wake up in the morning. Mm -hmm. What's the first thing I think of? Your car? <laughs> what? Going back to bed. So I'm not the only one here, am I right? Am I right? When I wake up in the morning, what's the first thing that I think about? Your cat. No. No, I don't. I think, I think about how much I hate going to work. We all hate going to work, which is why I go back to bed. I got a wrong answer point there. So did I. So that's one point to each other. Mm. If I could go anywhere on earth, where would it be and why? Japan, Cat Island. You got that right. <laughs> I knew it. Right, if I could go anywhere in the world, where would I go? You would go to that place where initial D's in Japan. Damn, she got that right as well. No points to any of us because we got it right. If someone dropped some money in front of you, like dropped a wallet, what was your first part of call? What would you think? What would you do? What would you do? 
Yeah, what would I do, sorry? What would I do? What would you think I would do? You'd go, ooh! And then you'd go, nah, and you'd go up to the person and give it back. I think she's half right there, but half wrong. I could just give it back to her. So I just said? Yeah, no, so you said you're half right, half wrong. How am I half wrong? Because you went, ooh, money! <laughs> I wasn't even joking about that. Oh my god. Ooh. No. <laughs> Nobody's really gonna go. Ooh. Okay, if somebody dropped money in front of me, what would be my reaction? I'm gonna quit work. I've already been paid. That's not correct. Yeah, you're lying. It's not correct. You're lying. It's not correct. And give it back. Oh my god, because that's not my money. It's not. You give the wallet back. We were like, oh, someone must have nicked the money and left it behind. No, I wouldn't. I'm an honest person. Somebody, you come there with, the design, with the designer boots and everything. You even come with a Ferrari and be like, "Oh, I'm sorry, yeah, this came with no money." And next thing you know, it turns out you spent it all. Nah, guys, I feel like um, this person, it's their money, they worked for it, whatever, and it, it's not up to me to like take that off somebody. So I just give back to the person, you know. One wrong point to ask them. If I had to play a very old video game, like a very very old video game, not Mario, by the way. Uh, if I had to play a very old video game, what is one game that will always be close to my heart? Gran Turismo. Eh, eh. I can't choose between either Sega Rally or Gran Turismo. Eh, eh. Both are wrong. What was it? The answer is the very first driver. I thought Gran Turismo was your favorite game. Driver is the first video game. <laughs> it had the foot. You know what? Grand driver one made what Grand Theft Auto is today. I, I still believe that. It's just some guy running around everywhere. Exactly. Which is exactly what every Grand Theft Auto is about. If a video game was close to my heart, what video game would that be, yo? You just said you play Minecraft. Uh, that's not my game of my. What's the. Heart. You're gonna put, the, put your heart in. <laughs> Grab your heart. Put it straight in there. Dude, dude. I would say. The very first Rayman. <laughs> no. No! No! That's shocking! The very first Tomb Raider. What? Just because you want to lock that old man in the fish <laughs> bar. Yeah! You know oh, what made that the best game? What made that better than Rayman? Do you know why? Because you couldn't jump over the old man in the fish bar and lock him in and he sort of glitched through the wall. <laughs> that a nice sat old was, guy. Sat, sat there with the tea and crumpets on, on a little plate. Next thing you know, he's like following you everywhere. No, do you know what it is? It's because we always used to play it at my grandma's house, so that's why I remember that game. Like, it was like a good game from our childhood, and it was really fun. If I was into any type of music growing up, right, any type of music growing up, we're talking about like any style, whatever, what style was it? This is where I put a video of that the song. <laughs> Say you'd be into trance music. Trance? <laughs> you think I'd be into trance growing up? Yeah, there is something. Trance? I'm so shocked. He thinks I'd be into trance music. And yeah, this is the guy who I was like, oh yeah. See, well, he's this, my this, is the, this is the same person that listened to No You're Gone on a phone with the, <laughs> the Polish version. Polish. Yeah, the poly version. Gagi go, gagi gagi gagi. I don't know what he says. Music. Yeah. What music I was into. Yeah. And Hina said, "Dead Mouth Five. Oh God, I don't Can know. Can everybody in the comments actually write it down how it's supposed to be, like said? I don't Dead Mouth Five. It's Dead Moose. Dead Moose. Dead Moose. Dead Moose. If I if I had to choose any restaurant and I could get it quick there and then, what what, what food would I have? What's my favourite food? Chicken. Apart from chicken. Apart from chicken. Yes. I'm gonna, I'm wrapping up. Oh the my difficulty. god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me take it away. Pizza. No. No. He has pizza like every day. Nope, not pizza. Pizza is good for everyday usage, but there's always that 
that, that every that, you know you always got that creme de la creme. I'm not, I'm not gonna eat loads of it, otherwise I'll hate it. I know. You, it already, is. you already said pizza. Yeah, you lost. I said chicken. I said chicken. It's the same thing. See, I'm right. Yeah, but I get Chinese food. Yeah, Chinese. But, yeah, but you get chicken. Chicken and Chinese food. It's, it's the same thing. Cross. Chicken shouldn't it's be still, Chinese it's still food. Chicken. Yeah, but chicken, you thought of chicken fried chicken. You have to be more specific. Yeah, but it's still chicken though. <sighs> Fine, I'll give you that one. If I had to choose any food, what would it be one? Chicken. Isn't it? Fried chicken. Chicken is the key, guys. See? Chicken is the key to my heart, you know? Yeah. Okay, we both got that you question, say, You right? say that, people are going to start mailing you chicken. Mail them in, guys. <laughs> you hit the word pop. And the chicken goes, Skrrr! Skrrr, and a tut, 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 tut. And a boom, boom, boom. I hate that song. Why? I think it's good. There is no lyrics to it. Man's not hot. <laughs> she told me to take up your jacket, so I told her, man's not hot. Man's not hot. Take off the jacket, but man's not hot. I told you, man's not hot. What does hot even mean? <laughs> and the music says ding ding, ding ding ding, ding ding ding, and you're like, what the hell is this? Mask off, <laughs> mask on, perksies, Molly perksies. <laughs> I dropped that pen. You're gonna screw it up on the way down. <laughs> You're gonna hashtag on the way. Yeah, hashtag, hashtag Mazda Hot, hashtag Big Shot, hashtag Big Dan, hashtag everything else. Yo, yeah. If I had to choose any movie in the world that I would assign to my life, if I had to be anyone in a movie character, who would I be? Forrest Gump. What the <laughs> hell are you talking about, <laughs> Forrest Gump? Back to the Future? How would that be you? I want to be Molly McFly. If I could be anybody in the movie, would it be one? That girl in Twilight. What? <laughs> what? Why would it be her? I haven't even seen Twilight. You'd be little Nicky. <laughs> Why? Why? Because you want to see me smack you in the face with a shovel. Right. That's my point down to you. <laughs> I'm going to smack you in the face with a shovel. It's not looking good for you so far. What's the direction of this? It's looking good, but you're the last. Right. If I could be any superhero, who would it be and why? You'd be the thing. Why? Because you wear the same. Right, that's one point down to it. Uh. If I was to be a superhero, I would be Spider Man. Why would you be Spider Man? Because I think he's cool as F. Because he wears a costume that covers what, all what, of it. Hang on, hang on. What does F mean? Cool as F. If I had to be a pro at any skill, what would it be? Drifting. She got that. Okay, if I could be a pro at any skill, what would it be one? Only a country. No? no? You wouldn't own a country? It's not a skill. But it is a skill to open a business and own a country. I want to become one of them super power lifter pe people who like lift loads. So you want to have like rip body six pack? Not like you, as much person. Like the last person you're going to go out with, you're just going to snap them in half. And yeah, why like not? A... It's good, it's good. It's all about them gains, yo. Yeah. What, what's my favorite color? White. Why? I don't cut paws are white. It's not white. You don't like his paws? I love his paws, but my favorite color is not white. Cut that wrong. It's cobalt blue. What is my favorite color? I think it's um very dark, like metallic red, like maroon. <laughs> what is it? Navy blue. Since when? It's always been navy blue. Since when? He's, I think he's making this up, you know, just for this video. Nope. He's, he's making this up. No, nope. navy blue. It's always been navy blue. <laughs> Doing? I'm mixing. Kneading the air. Yeah. Stop being so annoying. 
the elbow of death. If I had to go to uni, back to uni, what would I study? Nothing, because you wouldn't go back to uni. Exactly, you got that right. What would I do if I had to go back? Medicine, medical. Got that right. What sport have I always been good at? I don't see working out as a sport. I never see you do anything other than eat. <laughs> no, I don't know. Hockey! Oh Since my god! Hockey! I've got medals in my room, hockey player. You didn't even know that! I didn't even know you were into hockey. God damn! That's like. <laughs> what would my favourite sport be, would you say? What is sport? <laughs> uh, I went to the hospital because I had something wrong with my eyeball. The first thing they said to me is, Am I. Do I participate in any activities? Are you into any sports? My reply was, Motorsports? <laughs> and they sort of looked at me and said, Well, uh, Nah. No. Yeah, I didn't know what to say because technically it's it not. It is, it's technically a sport, it's isn't it? It is technically a sport, but to them it's not like a, I'm gonna get fit doing this at the same time. Let's tally them up, guys. Let's tally them up, let's right, have okay. a look. So, me, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven answers wrong. Oh, that's a lot of wrong questions. Right, you. That is a lot got, of wrong on, questions. With that, hasn't got five. Oh, see, five, five, six, five. Seven, eight. Nine? You got nine! Oh my god! Okay, so Hina, after I lost the challenge, Hina is now gonna fill this teaspoon full of chili sauce for this. Oh sauce. my god, look at it! Oh my god. Oh my god. This looks painful. Look at it. Oh, oh it's got chunks. Oh. 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 This is gonna really hurt me. Alright, okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> Eat it up! As well. <laughs> you know, a lot of your still wishes that you lost this because I don't want to. <laughs> oh, I can't even smell it, it's that strange. I'm just scared, man. <laughs> Go on. Do I seriously have to do this? Because yeah. this looks really, <laughs> really hot. I can actually see your face in that scene. <laughs> I command this particular drop of hot sauce to be really, <laughs> really hot. I'm gonna say do it, but you, you're not the one actually doing it, are you? Okay, half of it then. Being easy now. You just eat half of no, it. No, if I, I'm gonna have to go all the way. <laughs> it's gonna fall. It's gonna Ready? fall. Ready? Ready? Yeah, okay. Just swallow it and think of Jesus. Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> go on. Fireworks for me! Fireworks for me! <laughs> oh my god! Why did I agree to this challenge? I really thought you could do this. Oh. Oh. I need some milk, man. This is too much. <laughs> Get that damn camera on my face. Like this video, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next one.